Okay, hello everyone and welcome back to Hollow Knight. In this episode, I think in the last uh, part, I concluded that I should go back to Dirtmouth because we actually have quite a lot of uh, coins or whatever these things are called. Uh, yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Fuck, it's been a long time since I've played this game. Yeah, you know, after New Year, I was still kind of busy. I had work on Thursday and Friday, which was okay, it was pretty calm. Just, you know, we are still kind of winding down the holidays and all that. Uh, but I am ready to get back on the YouTube grind. So do these... Do these only... Oh, I don't get it. So you mark these... This is a one-time use, isn't it? No, it's not. Oh, so that's how you... Okay, I get it. I For a second, I thought that I already bought some of these, but it must have been like different things because I was like, wait, you have to buy one for every item you mark or every location, but no, that can't be. That can't be it. Okay. I found that already, haven't I? I'm pretty sure I did. It's that weird bug thing. Who well, I don't remember what she does. Uh, mask shard, what do we have? Grants you more time to recover after taking damage. Okay. Basically a lamp. What happens if I buy this? I feel like this is gonna be used for something. Hmm. See, I don't know if these are worth it. These are hella expensive. Yeah, but I mean, considering the fact that we'd get more HP and shit like that, technically that would be useful. But. <sighs> I'd rather buy more of these. Hot spring. Mark interesting spots. Okay, those are all to mark interesting spots. Okay. Oh, I'll buy that one. I'll buy the vendor pin. So does it retroactively go back and mark them? I don't know. All right, I think we're gonna go and leave it at that. Okay, it does mark, okay. Very, very good. Very good. All right, let's get back to where we just were. Sorry for wasting, well, not wasting. I mean, this is an RPG-ish game, Souls-like, so we have, to, we have to do some inventory management. I still have quite a lot of cash, but once I gather some more in wherever we go I will use it for I was in this one right I will use it for one of those mask fragments or whatever because why not so adorable this main character is hella adorable they really nailed all the des designs in this game yeah this fog canyon I don't remember if I've been to it I should have rested doesn't matter uh let's take a look. Oh wait, I remember which one the, the Fog Canyon is. That's that annoying ass area with uh, the exploding enemies. Oh wait a second. That it, this is, I just realized. Okay, hold on a bit. Precision platforming. I mean, the thing is, <laughs> the thing is we are extremely close to a resting spot so even if I die which I won't I could just come back here but I'm probably gonna spend hella time trying to get that item because you know me and precision platform I mean I, sh I should be okay at it uh, I have been playing actually a lot more super meat boy you know I s I played a bit of it to 
get footage for uh, the games of the decade list. Because, oh shit. Because surprisingly, I don't have Super Meat Boy footage. Oh fuck. Just laying around. Oh, that was. That was awesome. Um, okay, two more. It just felt really satisfying. I know it sounded like I blew a load or something, but uh, that was a really satisfying like little platforming. Not even puzzle, but just like a test of skill. So yeah, I have started playing Super Meat Boy just a little bit. It's a really, really fun. It's such an awesome game. Uh, it's a reason... There is a reason why it made it to the top in terms of the games list. It's not by accident, that's for sure. Yeah, um, I think we're gonna go back to the Mantis Village because as far as I rem oh shit. As far as I remember, we've determined, and this is the problem with sometimes taking like breaks or skipping time between recording sessions is that you have no clue what you were doing. Oh, hello. I have a map of this area. What the fuck? I feel like I'm getting ripped off if I buy a map. Hmm. Yeah, this way is where some real shit was. If I remember correctly, I got stuck here somewhere, right? So it's like I gotta re recollect. Oh, this is here. Okay. We've been here. Yeah. No worries. So I did determine that the Mantis Village is where we actually gotta go. And there's like this canyon area before it. Or after it, whatever. So that's exactly what we're gonna do. Uh actually get this episode started Cause so far hell yeah this wall jump is awesome man it's got potential you know you can feel the potential I'm sure there is a ton of areas I can now access oh this is what I assume double jump. I think we've determined this. Yeah. That we would need some kind of... Ouch. Okay. Wonderful. I just took... I would... I, I wanted to say the most damage. So far, but then again, that's not really true, is it? We've taken hella damage. Okay. There should be... A path in the middle... That leads downwards. I forgot there's actual enemies here. Pretty sure there was. Shit. I aggroed. Oh, it's like... Interesting. I'm assuming... Yeah, okay. I was gonna say, I'm assuming I cannot break that. So... We will probably be getting some sort of... I don't know. Screw attack. Always with the Metroid. Metroid? Did I just say Metroid? Metroid references. <laughs> Metroid. That's how... I don't know who says it. Nobody. That self-attacking thing is really good, though. It's a good charm. Alright, nowhere to go but down. Okay, this... We might be in trouble here. We are kind of in trouble. Not anymore. Still kind of, yeah. 
If I don't have shit to heal myself with. Don't have that bong power. Okay, hello. What does that mark? Like waypoint? Oh, it's like a way station or whatever. How did I miss this? Okay, before I die. I am like actually legit. I'm gonna get myself killed. Which I really kind of don't want to do. Hell yeah. That's all we needed. That's all we wanted. All we wanted and all we needed. We are going into a new area. I'm assuming it is... Good that I picked up this wall jump. There was something... Hello. I don't know if you're an enemy or not. It didn't look like an enemy. What is this, like a fucking sewer? Oh, please, not a sewer area. This game's with them sewer areas. Dash Master. Okay. I thought this would be... Or well, something a little bit more substantial. We could have come here before either, as well. Honestly. How are we going to get to you? I think it's like hypnotized or something. Well, cool. Are we officially about to have a uh, where the fuck do I go type mom moment? That is a dead end. Okay. Let's sit here. And once I figure out how to manage inventory. Dash master. Oh, dash downward. Want to move around as quickly as possible. Uh, da, 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 da. I don't know. Whisp what, what does this do? Whispers its location to the bearer whenever the map is open, allowing wanderers to pinpoint their current location. Oh, okay. I mean, I I think I'll be okay without that. If this is any... But hold on, can't you like... Basically, not cheat with this, but... You know what I mean. Get to areas where you're not supposed to get. Or is this a type of item that's like mandatory, but... Not mandatory? That's hella good. Downward dash. Because I feel like... This is like some sequence breaking shit. I mean, maybe it's designed in a way, I don't know, where you cannot do that, but who knows? Can I just say I have no idea where the fuck we need to go? I think it's pretty safe to say that this area... We've covered this area. There's nowhere else we can really go. Uh, oops. So I think what I'm gonna do. Oh, hello. How the hell did I miss this? What I'm gonna say once I, yeah, okay, I still got hit. What I was gonna say is, I think we'll go back to the Queen Station because there is one more area where I haven't been able to make much progress. And that area... Okay, actually, I'll take it back. This is kind of confusing. Not knowing your location. Okay, that was like doubly fucked up. That mine area from way back at the start. I think maybe. Maybe just maybe with the... Okay, this is where I pick up, picked up the dash, right? Maybe just maybe 
I can now proceed there. It's not guaranteed, but I'm like really trying to think of whether I've like encountered any place here that I've not explored. And I think no. So, you know, gotta take it Metroidvania style. If you're stuck somewhere, go somewhere else. I will admit this has not been the most productive episode of Hollow Knight so far. Am I going the wrong way? I think not. See, okay, you know what, that map marker is kind of bug that I lost it. Or I de-equipped it. Okay, no, this is good. What was up here? I think I've explored this place already, right? Yeah, yeah, I have. I still don't know about this dash, man. Like... To me, it still seems like you can do some cheating shit with it. Like, you know how you can like basically break Metroid as well from the start. With like some sequence breaking stuff. It's not the right way. You can probably do shit like that in this game as well. Because Metroid, you need the... I don't remember the long jump. That's when you can like start some shit, right? And to me, this kind of feels like that, you know. Now that I can actually comment on that game that I've played it. That's, that was one of those games that I, like, you know, missed out on. I mean, it was... Pri not Prime. Uh, Super Metroid. I'm talking about Super Metroid was before me, technically. Uh, or I was very little when it came out. So I kind of missed out on it, but... Thanks to the SNES Classic, you know. We got it covered. And hopefully I'm going the right way. And this is like the only thing I can think of. Oh, hello. Hey there. Okay, just roast me. Arena? He's not gonna be too friendly. Okay, let me just... So we are on at... On at the station. Cool. Man, I really gotta get back that marker. I hella don't know where the, where the fuck I am. Okay. This is bad. Probably should have entered from dirt mouth. Really? Oh, wait a second. There's probably again new areas I can access now. Speaking of... Honest, yeah, I've been here already. I ju just gotta get like one of these landmarks to be able to... Whoa, okay. That's interesting. Non-wall jumpable. Hold on. Can you? Yes, you can. Just gotta time it right. And I don't have the most HP in the world. Let me just heal myself, because... This is gonna probably take a couple of attempts. Shit, that's difficult. 
Maybe you do need to dash. Kinda. Fuck. See, I call cheating on the fact that the side spikes hurt you. Oh man. Wait, I, I have the double dash, don't I? Okay, I'm not not about to die. I still I'm still kinda of bunk. I mean Damn I'm not doing anything in this episode, am I? I gotta be like more productive. This this game is very distracting because you always start thinking about where you could go with some of these like new abilities you have. And it's always like it always ends up with me getting distracted. Okay. It's much clearer. Much, much clearer. See, I am lazy enough to get rid of my probably super useful on paper double dash. Just to be able to know where I am on the map. I am like that. It's all about that convenience, you know. I'm like that with Dark Souls as well, you know. People sometimes get mad at me because I don't optimize stuff, you know, in terms of the builds. I tend to just, like, do shit. People are always, like, pissed on why I'm not doing certain things. And I'm like... You know, who cares? If you can make it through the game, why not just go for convenience, right? Please tell me I can do something here. Uh, this is like really... This is like really speaking to me, you know, that I'll be able to do... I won't be able to, because you need something else here. Shit. I'm going to be honest with you. It is very, very possible that we are officially stuck. There is one more. Do you see that little path? Okay. We cannot be stuck. No way. Uh, if we are actually stuck, there is always game facts to help us out. Man, game facts. It's still around. I mean, that's the thing. But, you know, I remember when text walkthroughs were all the rage. Every game had like a fucking long ass text walkthrough which was fine of course helpful but just like you know think back now you just look on youtube for everything okay i don't think i've actually been here I'm disappointed. I really thought this was gonna be... Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Well, there is the other side as well. Haven't explored it fully. And then after that, we're going to the green path because I am desperate to figure out where the fuck we need to go, which means we gotta start wondering. Man, this is a productive episode. I really didn't, you know. I always, I'm always making excuses I shouldn't, but it's this type of game, you know. This type of game, to be honest, lends itself to sometimes just being lost and wandering around. Just how it is, you know. There was an NPC in here, if I remember correctly. Yeah, I think we moved her. That was the map wife, right? I think it was. 
Oh, you know what? Oh no, we've been able to get up here before. But then still it's not like fully completed this area, which is a weird thing. Oh, hello. I don't remember you. Charm store. Okay, this is more like it. Seep, seeps lifeblood and will certainly improve your constitution. Well, you know. Could the nail be a little longer? Well, you know. Whatever. Let's leave it at that. Okay. Spells last longer. Yes. I am hella getting that. That's super useful. And this long nail honestly kind of interests me because more weapon reach, I'm all about that life. So we have two more slots. Perfect. Oh yeah, that that is good. That is bueno excelente. I knew this excursion would be worth it, even though I just lost a shit ton of life. Hey, hey. The end result is still the same. I'm going to be honest with you boys. I am lost as fuck, as in... I don't know where exactly we got to go. But... This is probably the best ability I've picked up in this game yet. Which makes me very happy. However... I mean, we need like a ticket or something. However... Unfortunately, the only thing I can do is wrap it up here. Uh, we gotta get to... I think the green path... Is like the only conceivable place that we'd be able to get to where I haven't I haven't like done everything it's very possible or that area with those exploding jellyfish or whatever those things were there might be some things there because I will be honest with you that on that area was so annoying that I haven't oh hello that I did not explore it fully all right, what I'm going to go ahead and do is I'll wrap it up here. Uh, I want to thank you guys very much for watching. And what I said in, if you follow me on Discord, which if you're not, you should. What I said is true. Wait a second. It's like he throws his weapon or something. Weird. Um, what I meant is I'm really back on the YouTube grind from today. So, streams, content, also, I'm shamelessly plugging my Instagram always, Mr. Underscore Sketchhead. It's in the description because I'm doing a lot of stuff on there, music-related stuff. So, if you're in interested in that, check me out. I'll wrap it up here. Let's go to the green path. Thanks for watching, boys, and goodbye.